This video shows a four-point bending test on a timber beam with the grain running parallel to the beam axis. Here, the specimen has a defect near the bottom of the beam. The timber is made of sawn timber class C24. The loading diagram shows the simple supported beam subjected to four-point bending. Under this loading arrangement, the bending moment in the central part of the beam is constant. A pair of equal vertical loads is now starting to be applied to the central part of the specimen and we begin to see the beam bending under the load. As the beam deflects, we see cracks appearing near the knot. Fracture occurs when the extreme stresses in the tensile zone reach the failure stress of the wood. Now, if we slow down the footage, we can see cracks appearing first in the knot before splitting failure occurs above the knot. The force displacement graph is roughly straight corresponding to elastic bending of the beam. Since the knot has reduced the tensile capacity of wood in the bottom fibers, the ultimate strength of the beam is reached before significant crushing in the compressive zone and the point of failure is sudden at just under 12.5 kN. This is about half of the failure load that we would expect for a similar beam with no defects.